right, so, uh, who am I? Um, I'm Max. I'm 24, just had a birthday. Got a bunch of kids, run a business. Just trying to kind of sort things out. I, uh, I have a lot of interests. I have a lot of hobbies that I've always well, used to be heavily involved in. And I feel like I've kind of lost a lot of my passion and drive for those things over the years. I mean, everybody knows life's hard and things get you down. And I just kind of don't want to squander that. I was always thought I have so much potential and that's the thing about potential it's it, it, it is what it is whether you do anything with it or not and you can look at it as motivation or you can look at it as pressure or you can look back and be upset that you wasted it and that's one of my greatest fears is that you know I get to the end of my life and I look back and I haven't accomplished shit and that's kind of how I feel to this point. Like I said, I'm 24. I just recently had a birthday, and it kind of hit me pretty hard. But, you know, for as much as I've done, I don't feel like I've accomplished anything. That's truly something to be proud of. And I don't know. I have a lot of people that depend on me. I have a lot of people that I feel like I'm letting down every day. And I uh, kind of gets to you after a while. And I just figured that it was time to try to make a change. And I don't know where or how or what, but I figured doing something's better than nothing. So, yeah, I've, like I said, I got a lot of interests. Um, big into music and video games. And it's kind of hard to think of things on the spot, but. You know, human psychology, I like all the sciences, I like interesting stories. I'm definitely not any kind of storyteller, as you can probably tell by my uh, constant pauses and stutters and restating myself. I've got kind of a difficult time keeping track of my thoughts in my brain, so I tend to ramble a little bit. But maybe this will help me get better at that. I used to be a very outgoing person, and able to strike up a conversation with pretty much anybody and I kind of prided myself on that but I find that that's something that I've kind of lost over the last couple of years like I said I don't want to get too far into specifics I don't know how personal I'll end up being on a detail oriented sort of level but you know I went through a pretty low patch and I'm still kind of in it but I don't know, I just kind of realized that I can feel bad for myself. I can feel bad about the circumstances that have happened to me and the things people have done to me in my life. But at the end of the day, nobody gets to decide who I am but me. And if I get to decide, then I want to be someone successful. And I want to be someone that the people that I love can be proud of. And not just someone who goes through the motions to get through the days, to get through the weeks, to get through the months, and you look back and it's all a blur. And then, you know, I can't tell one day from the next. I feel lost. I feel frustrated. I lose my temper. I lose my passion. I lose myself a little bit. And that's one of the biggest things that I struggle with is... Who am I? I don't know anymore. I used to have a lot of ideas about myself and who I was and what I felt about things and what I wanted to do with my life. And that all kind of got shaken up. And now I'm just trying to sort that back out. And I've always wanted to create things. Um, when I was younger, I was very into creating things with my hands in the way of like woodworking, metalworking. I like to make knives, I like to make random little trinkets and gifts for my friends and things like that and I've kind of lost touch with all of that and now with my living situation I'm not really able to, you know, do those kind of things anymore but I figure I still have the drive, I still like making something from nothing so 
if I can't do it that way, I might as well do it somehow. And uh, that's where I get into, you know, what do I want to do? I, I, I reach out to little things, and I kind of been one of those people that bounce from hobby to hobby, and I never really stick with anything for very long, so I don't know. I'd like to have something that I can really dedicate myself to, to, you know, make something of myself other than just another guy who has a job and who has kids and, you know, that's it maybe it's self-aggrandizing but I'd like to think that I can be more than that that I can reach out and experience the world and feel things that are real and that's something that I've noticed a lot lately is things feel less and less real and I just feel more and more estranged from, well, reality, I guess. I get lost in my head. I, I don't know. I don't even know what I'm saying right now. I don't know how much of this is going to be usable. I've kind of ranted for a little bit off see what it turns out to be but yeah basically to summarize it all up I'm just some dude who was always under the impression that I was going to make something of my life and now I look back and I'm not a kid anymore I'm an adult I've got a family I've got people who count on me and rely on me and I still haven't done anything that is worth anything and I think it's time to change that and what better time to start than now because if it's five ten years in the future and i then i decide to start doing something i'm going to be that far behind so even though clearly i don't know what i'm doing here that's what this is for now and hopefully it won't be like that for long hopefully i'll kind of get a groove and i'll figure out what i want to do and where i want to go and i think that'll feel good i think that'll be good for me mentally i think that'll be fulfilling in a way that a lot of things haven't been as of late so yeah that's about it that's me max two x's in the name that is <laughs> uh, well if anybody hears this thank you and i'll see you around